Hi guys, today's video is going to be a 90s Gwen Stefani inspired makeup look. So yeah, I'll just jump straight in. So for foundation, I'm going to be using L'Oreal's Infallible 24 Hour Matte Foundation in the colour Porcelain. This is my everyday foundation and I highly recommend it. It's a drugstore foundation, it's only 7 quid and a little bit goes a long way. At the moment this is my favourite foundation and then I'm taking half of a beauty blender and just putting it all over my face. By the way, watching this video and editing it was so funny. Like the amount of faces that I pull when I'm trying to blend foundation is hilarious. Okay, and once my foundation is set, I'm taking this eBay Contour and Concealer Palette, and I kid you not, this is one of the best I've ever used. And I'm taking one of the fair shades and just packing it on under my eyes because I have very dark circles, unfortunately. And I'm also taking some of the green and some of the red to replace some dark areas and some red spots, like that disgusting one on my chin. Then I'm taking Too Faced Born This Way Concealer in the lightest shade and I'm taking it under my eyes, down my nose, on my chin, yada yada. Then I'm taking that same contour concealer palette and using two of the darkest colours and I love this so much because it blends so easily and all of the other cream contours that I've used take so long to blend and because I'm so pale usually they just look like a big brown stripe on the side of my face but I feel that this one gives a lot more of a natural look. Ah, it looks so great. Alright, then I'm using Rimmel Stay Matte Pressed Powder. I'm not sure what shade it is, but it's almost gone. I need to get a new one. But yeah, I'm just using a brush and packing that on my face. Then my favourite part, highlighter. I'm using the Balm's Mary Lou highlighter. Oh, it's so pretty. And for brows, I'm using my absolute favourite Sleek Eyebrow Palette. I use this for my eyebrows every day. It's amazing. Again, another drugstore brand. It is the shit, if I do say so myself. I spend ages doing my eyebrows. I always feel like it's such a task to try and replicate it on the other side. Then I'm using W7's In The Mood palette and I just use this to set my brows. I'm using the brown colour on an angled brush. I'm just shaping them a bit more. Then I'm using Anastasia Beverly Hills' Modern Renaissance palette. I'm using this taupe kind of colour all over my lid and this dark brown colour on the outer corners. And I'm using a Anastasia Beverly Hills' eyeshadow brush as well as a CoverGirl blending brush. I'm then taking this orange colour and sweeping it under my eye. I think this adds a pop of colour because the rest of it is quite muted. Then I'm using Benefit's Roller Lash Mascara and curling my lashes. This is also my favourite mascara because I have really sensitive eyes and I really recommend this one. To line my lips I'm using Kylie Cosmetics True Brown K Liner. Then I'm using Jeffree Star's liquid lipstick in Unicorn Blood. And yeah, that's my completed look. I love this so much, especially with my hair done like this. I feel like you could go a lot more extreme with this look with a bit more of a grungy eye look. To add a little something and make it a bit more grungy and more iconically Gwen Stefani, I added two small dots to mimic Gwen's 
bindi that she always wore. And that's it, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video, hit thumbs up if you did, and also hit subscribe, I really appreciate it if you do, and I'll see you guys next time, bye!